Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to this channel. On this video, I'm actually going to be talking about a new tool that I just picked up. This is going to be a battery analyzer from King Bolin. So they recently reached out to me to test out this battery analyzer. I personally don't have this in my toolbox, so this is something that I'm, I'm happy to add to my toolbox set. And what this actually does is it analyzes your battery, it tests your cold crank uh, amps, it, it tests out your voltage. It basically gives you an idea of the health of your battery. Um, in, in the past where I had family members or friends that are, were not sure about their battery, they wanted me to, to figure out what was going on. I had to basically instruct them to go to like an O'Reilly's for them to do a quick test. And uh, pretty much they would be purchasing a new battery after that. That's usually the case. Uh, but what this does again is it analyzes your battery. It'll let you know how the health is, how much percentage is left on a lot of the cold cranking amps. And it'll also give you the current voltage and basically the health of how your battery is doing. I'm going to show you both my working battery, which is I'm using a current Odyssey battery. Um, and I'm also going to be showing you a dead battery so yeah, you guys can both see the meter readings on those. So let's go ahead and get into this reader. So this is the battery analyzer. It reads 6 volt, 12 volt, and 24 volts. Um, there's also a over voltage input protection. There's a polarity reverse protection. Uh, this is your, your, your SOC and your SOH test, which stands for your status of health and the status of the charge. And it's again, compatible with different types of voltages here. Now again, it doesn't need any battery because it uses the battery on your car battery. So that's very nice. You never have to run out of, you never have to make sure that this is uh, gonna be charged or not. Now what I'm running here again is going to be an Odyssey battery. It, I'll go ahead and uh, drop a link below in case you guys are interested in this battery. I've had this for about a good two years now. It's been great as it hasn't failed me. Um, overall, again, I really like this battery. I'm going to go ahead and plug in the negative and I'm going to go ahead and plug in the positive side. Okay, so as you see the meter powered on briefly, I'm going to turn that on and it's going to be at 12 volts and it's going to head and read the meter readings now. Um, it shows that the cold cranking amp is at 90, 904, uh, which is good. Uh, the next stat is going to be the voltage 12.23. So that's also good right here. It says indicated good. Um, this is, I believe the ohms. So I'm not really sure how the, how to read this one personally, but it does say that it's good as well. And the status of the charge is 38%. That's good. And the status of health is 71, which is also considered good. So not exactly sure what percentages I'm looking at in particular, but it does say the status is good. So that does show that the health of my battery is good. So this is a, uh, probably a good way to kind of test the battery before going out on a long trip. Uh, that's something that can be included into a trick, uh, a, a trip checklist. So let's go ahead and take a look at a bad battery. So what I've got here is a bad battery. Uh, I need to recycle this, but I'm glad that I still have this so I can show you guys uh, how a bad battery reading looks like. Let's go ahead and plug this in. All right, let's go ahead and turn it on. 12 volts. So it shows the co-cranking amps at 42. It shows that as poor. Uh, the status of health is 1% poor or one score poor. Uh, the status of charge at zero poor. And the ohm reading, I believe, is also the six, which is poor. Voltage is under the 12 volts, 11.85 poor. And there you go. So there you have it guys, super easy to use battery analyzer. It's nice to have one in the toolbox. You never know when you're gonna need it. Super lightweight, doesn't need battery at all. I'll drop a link below in case you guys are interested. Again, thanks for uh, reaching out to me, King Bolin, for uh, product testing this. And I'll catch you guys on that next video.